Pluto is a remote and enigmatic dwarf planet that was previously part of our solar system's planetary group. However, recent astonishing declarations by prominent astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and MIT's Michio Kaku have brought Pluto back into the limelight with a startling disclosure. They propose that this icy realm is on a possible collision trajectory with Neptune. But how could this occur, and what would be the ramifications of such a significant event? Are we observing a rare astronomical occurrence? Or is there something more to this looming cosmic impact? Join us as we examine the potential for a Pluto-Neptune collision. Pluto, once classified as a planet and later demoted to a dwarf planet due to its unusual orbit, continues to captivate and engage the astronomical community. According to recent forecasts by leading scientists, Pluto's path is perilously close to Neptune's. Renowned astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku are both sounding the alarm about a possible dangerous collision between these two celestial bodies that could pose a significant risk to Earth. How is such an event even conceivable? Pluto's journey around the Sun is unlike that of any other planet in our solar system. It takes an astonishing 248 years to complete a single orbit, meaning that since its discovery in 1930, it hasn't even finished one complete revolution. Yet the intrigue does not end there. Pluto's trajectory is characterized by its highly elliptical form, diverging considerably from the nearly circular orbits of the major planets. What makes Pluto's orbit even more peculiar is its inclination, tilted at 17 degrees to the ecliptic plane. The path Pluto follows is much steeper compared to the other planets. This tilt and elliptical nature add layers of complexity to its orbital behavior. One of the most fascinating features of Pluto's orbit is its intersection with Neptune's path. For about 20 years during each orbit, Pluto actually moves closer to the Sun than Neptune, defying what we might anticipate from their positions in the solar system. This leads to the fundamental question. Why hasn't Pluto collided with Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational influences of other planets. The study of Pluto's orbit commenced soon after its discovery. Initially, astronomers found it challenging to comprehend its distinctive trajectory. Unlike the other planets, whose orbits are relatively close to the ecliptic plane, Pluto's path stood out due to its steep inclination and elliptical shape. The mystery deepened with the realization that Pluto's orbit indeed crosses that of Neptune. The stability of Pluto's orbit amidst these complexities is evidence of the intricacies of celestial mechanics. The three-body problem in astronomy involves understanding how three objects in space, like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, move and influence each other through their gravitational pulls. It's akin to trying to forecast their movement based on their initial positions and how they exert forces on one another. In Pluto's scenario, this problem illustrates how its trajectory, Neptune's path, and the Sun's gravity interact in a complicated manner. The terms alpha libration and latitude libration, along with the VZK oscillation, are integral to this puzzle. According to astrophysicists, what keeps all planets in their orbits is a phenomenon known as alpha libration. In relation to Pluto and Neptune, this term indicates that whenever Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, it is positioned at least 90 degrees away from Neptune. This spatial separation is crucial in preventing their paths from colliding. Latitude libration, on the other hand, refers to the vertical movement of a celestial body within its orbit. For Pluto, this means that when it approaches Neptune or any other giant planet, it is situated significantly above their orbital plane, providing an additional layer of protection from potential collisions. Another vital component in this equation is the VZK oscillation, named after three scientists, Bon, Zippel, and Kai, who investigated how celestial bodies move in space. This phenomenon involves how three space objects, such as Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, exert gravitational forces on one another. This interaction affects their motion. In Pluto's case, VZK helps us comprehend why its orbit around the Sun is so unusual. Even though Pluto's path may appear erratic, this oscillation helps maintain its smooth movement over extended periods. The VZK oscillation reveals that even if events in space seem chaotic and random, certain patterns and rules ensure order. All of these elements contribute to the stability of Pluto's orbit, ensuring it does not collide with Neptune or veer off course. 
This three-body problem aids in understanding how these trajectories change due to the gravitational interactions among these celestial objects. Investigating this helps us learn more about Pluto, our solar system, and distant worlds and their stars. Numerical simulations conducted in the late 1980s revealed that despite these stable characteristics, Pluto's orbit is technically chaotic, with minor variations in initial conditions leading to significant differences over millions of years. Nevertheless, these unique properties of Pluto's orbit have been found to maintain stability over incredibly long time frames, effectively keeping chaos at bay. Recent computational tests have helped elucidate how the larger planets, such as Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn, influence Pluto's path around the Sun. Neptune has a unique connection with Pluto, where for every two orbits Pluto completes around the Sun, Neptune completes three. This connection aids in maintaining Pluto's stable trajectory. However, Neptune isn't the sole contributor. Jupiter's gravity also plays a significant role in keeping Pluto's orbit secure and stable, and Saturn contributes slightly as well. These tests indicate that Jupiter's gravitational force alone is sufficient to ensure Pluto remains on a stable path for an extended period, even billions of years. Thus, it's as if Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn are collaborating to ensure Pluto continues its safe journey through space without encountering difficulties. These phenomena are essential for preserving order and predictability in celestial movement within the universe. Without these mechanisms, the solar system as we know it would be a realm of greater chaos and unpredictability. Objects like Pluto could potentially collide with others or be ejected from their stable orbits, causing a domino effect on other celestial bodies. For Pluto, especially amidst discussions about its potential collision with Neptune in the future. Comprehending its orbit is of utmost importance. This provides us with a clearer view of the solar system's dynamic nature. The case of Pluto illustrates how even the most seemingly unstable orbits can achieve a state of equilibrium through the intricate interplay of gravitational forces and orbital mechanics. It also underscores the necessity for continuous observation and study of these phenomena to better understand our position in the universe. Delving into the depths of space often leads us to confront the unpredictable nature of celestial bodies, and Pluto's orbit serves as a prime example of this unpredictability. The concept of orbital chaos, which refers to the sensitive dependence of a celestial body's path on its initial conditions, is vividly demonstrated in Pluto's case. This implies that even minor variations in the dwarf planet's position or speed can considerably alter its long-term trajectory. In the vastness of our solar system, Pluto occupies a singular position that challenges our understanding of planetary classification and dynamics. Since its discovery in 1930, Pluto has undergone extensive research, resulting in significant revelations about its composition and behavior. One of the most captivating aspects of Pluto is its exterior, which is a complex patchwork of ice, rock, and various substances. The New Horizons mission, which flew by Pluto in July 2015, delivered unparalleled insights into this remote world. Pluto's surface is characterized by expansive plains, soaring mountains, and deep canyons. A particularly remarkable feature is Sputnik Planitia, a vast heart-shaped plain primarily composed of nitrogen ice. This area displays a wide variety of geological traits, including enormous icebergs and what appear to be flowing glaciers. The existence of these characteristics implies that Pluto may still be geologically active despite its significant distance from the sun and frigid temperatures. Another fascinating element of Pluto is its atmosphere, which is mainly made up of nitrogen, with small amounts of methane and carbon monoxide. Although thin, Pluto's atmosphere exhibits intriguing seasonal variations. As Pluto nears the sun in its elongated orbit, its atmosphere can expand and contract. This dynamic behavior reflects the complex relationship between Pluto and its surroundings. During its closest approach to the sun, some atmospheric gases may freeze onto the surface, while as it moves farther away, these gases can sublimate back into the atmosphere. The interaction between Pluto and its largest moon, Charon, adds additional intricacy to the system. Charon is relatively large compared to Pluto, with a diameter about half that of Pluto itself. This size ratio means that both bodies orbit around a point in space that lies between them, rather than Pluto simply revolving around Charon. 
This distinctive relationship contributes to the intricate gravitational dynamics in the region, affecting the orbits of other objects in the Kuiper Belt. The Kuiper Belt, a zone beyond Neptune filled with small icy bodies, hosts numerous other dwarf planets and potential impactors. This belt acts as a reservoir of ancient materials from the early solar system, providing scientists a glimpse into its formation. Pluto's orbital characteristics might offer insights into the migration patterns of these distant objects, indicating that interactions with larger planets may have played a crucial role in shaping their current orbits. One of the key implications of understanding Pluto's orbital dynamics is the potential influence on our comprehension of the solar system's evolution. The gravitational effects from nearby giant planets like Jupiter and Neptune can alter the paths of smaller bodies, including those in the Kuiper Belt. Such interactions can lead to changes in orbits, potentially resulting in collisions or ejections from the solar system. As researchers continue to explore the complexities of these interactions, they may uncover broader patterns that govern the behavior of celestial bodies throughout the galaxy. The study of Pluto also raises philosophical questions about classification in astronomy. The decision to reclassify Pluto as a dwarf planet in 2006 was contentious, sparking debates about what defines a planet. The International Astronomical Union's definition emphasized criteria such as orbital dominance and size, prompting many to consider the implications of such classifications. This ongoing dialogue reflects our evolving understanding of the universe and highlights the need for a flexible approach to categorizing celestial entities. Moreover, the potential for future exploration of Pluto and the Kuiper Belt remains an exciting frontier. With advancements in technology and mission planning, scientists envision sending additional spacecraft to investigate not only Pluto, but also other distant objects that share its orbital characteristics. Such missions could yield valuable data about the primordial materials that shaped our solar system, potentially offering clues to the origins of life on Earth. The role of exoplanets or planets outside our solar system is another fascinating area of inquiry that intersects with our understanding of Pluto. As astronomers discover an increasing number of exoplanets, especially in the habitable zones of their stars, the insights gained from studying our own solar system can enhance theories about planetary formation and habitability. The conditions that allow for stable orbits, atmospheric retention, and geological activity could shed light on the potential for life elsewhere in the universe. Finally, public fascination with Pluto has persisted, driven by its enigmatic nature and the stunning images transmitted by the New Horizons mission. The dwarf planet has captured the imagination of people worldwide inspiring a renewed appreciation for the vastness of space and our position within it. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of Pluto and the celestial bodies in its vicinity, we are reminded of the infinite wonders that the universe holds. Do Pluto's distinctive traits extend beyond its physical attributes and orbit? It also serves as a crucial case study for understanding planetary formation and the dynamics of celestial bodies. Pluto's formation is believed to have occurred in the early solar system alongside other Kuiper Belt objects. Examining its composition can illuminate the conditions present during the solar system's infancy, potentially informing theories about the formation of terrestrial planets, including Earth. Recent studies suggest that Pluto may harbor a subsurface ocean, an insight that could reshape our understanding of its geology and potential for supporting life. Data from the New Horizons mission indicated that certain regions of Pluto's surface, such as the icy mountains, may consist of water ice, which behaves differently than conventional rock under low temperatures. This revelation invites further exploration into the possibility of liquid water existing beneath its icy crust, raising intriguing questions about the potential for life even in such extreme environments. Additionally, Pluto's interactions with its surroundings can provide insights into atmospheric science. The seasonal variations in its thin atmosphere present a natural laboratory for studying atmospheric dynamics on a planetary scale. Scientists are particularly interested in how the interplay between solar radiation and the surface can lead to complex weather patterns similar to those observed on larger planets. The significance of ongoing observation of Pluto and other similar celestial bodies cannot be overstated. As more missions are planned, such as those targeting the outer reaches of the Kuiper Belt, 
we can anticipate a wealth of new information that challenges existing theories and broadens our understanding of planetary science. Each discovery adds another piece to the puzzle of our solar system's history and the processes that govern its evolution. Through these explorations, Pluto remains a symbol of the continuous quest for knowledge about our universe, inviting both scientists and enthusiasts alike to ponder the mysteries that lie beyond our earthly realm.